Hello, it is Vlogmas day four. I don't know how that's possible. This is flying by. Today, I felt like doing a little Christmas date night with my boyfriend. There he is. So we are on our way to Target to get a few things for our little date night. Christmas edition. It's gonna be cute, it's gonna be festive. I think this is my excuse to drink hot chocolate and watch a Christmas movie, but it's a good excuse and I'll take it. Jolly, very, merry, <laughs> okay. Cute. So I have our stuff right here. I'm gonna throw it into the washer really, really quick. And then I got these trees for a dollar. We're going to paint them tonight. A little arts and crafts project, you know, that would be cute and quirky. Ooh, they're so warm. I can't wait to put this on. <laughs> Me and my boyfriend are both changed in our pajamas and we are matching from head to toe. It feels so wrong, but also a little bit right. Just a, just a little bit. We're going to do a little fit check for you guys. We have the matching pants on and then we have our little... <laughs> <laughs> Stop I'm laughing. We have our little socks. Very merry and holly jolly. That's stupid. Oh, and then we have these shirts on. Group. So the first thing we're going to do on this magical, wonderful, holly jolly Christmas date night is we're going to make chocolate chip cookies. And then we're going to make hot chocolate and eat the cookies with the hot chocolate. Mm, it's gonna be delicious. Oh my god, I also forgot that we got eggnog and it's lactate because somebody, somebody is um, lactose intolerant. His tummy can't handle milk. What a loser, right? Anywho, sorry. Let me shut that. I got this chocolate chip cookie dough to make. Ooh. Do you want to try some? Like raw? <laughs> yeah. I thought you needed specific raw ones. Jeremy, I mean, <laughs> maybe, but you can eat as much raw cookie dough as you'd like. Do you want to try some? No, I'm good. Okay, well, I will be eating this much, and then I will let you guys know if I get sick. But I'm not going to get sick because I'm a stronger person than Jeremy. <laughs> Agree or disagree? I'm built better. Oh my god. Jeremy, you can't leave it like that. <laughs> It's not supposed to look. No, it doesn't, it's not supposed to look like that. Um, okay, so this is what Jeremy's looks like, and then this is what mine looks like. Look how beautiful this looks. Look how ugly, 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 ugly. Okay, on that note, it's time to put this in the oven. Now we wait. Oh, that's weird. Yours are kind of ugly. Ooh, look how good mine look. Oh my God, look at this giant stack of cookies. So, even though we are adults, I feel like no good date night is complete without doing an arts and crafts project. So, as you guys saw, I got these little trees from Target. We're going to paint them. You guys at home can decide whose tree looks better. I know that it will be mine. After our little arts and crafts project, we're going to make hot chocolate and watch a Christmas movie. I hate to say it, but I think that I have the best hot chocolate recipe. It's not a recipe, I shouldn't say that. I think that I have the best hot chocolate hack. I don't know what I'm doing. Jeremy. I'm watching you to learn. Oh my God. I didn't paint since kindergarten. I forgot, me and Jeremy are very much very opposite of each other in the way that Jeremy is very technology nerd, data entry. And I like to do arts and crafts and I like to do YouTube. Jeremy is still very creative, but we're just creative in different ways, which is why Jeremy is painting a green tree and I'm painting a pink tree. That tells you all you need to know right there. Okay, are you done? Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is what they look like. Cute! I feel like yours is a lot cuter. 
I'll be honest, it's so much more Christmassy. Please do not tell me whose you like more. <laughs> I do not want to hear it. <laughs> okay, so now that we finished our little DIY, <laughs> I think that it's time for hot chocolate, cookies, and a Christmas movie. Ta -da. This is about to be cozy. Now it is time for me to reveal my world famous top secret hot chocolate recipe. That's not actually a recipe, that's not actually world famous, but um, you know what it is? It is delicious. So <laughs> I'm gonna show you how I make it. Step one is getting your favorite mug. It has to be cute. If it's not cute, this will not work. And then you take it over to your Keurig. This is the kind I use. Pop that thing right in there. There she goes. So now you go back into your fridge and you get this creamer. Okay, so then you add way too much creamer. Probably like uh, that much. It is going to feel like a lot and that is because it is a lot. Okay, so both of these are made and now we're going to do a little taste test for you. Bug bang. Please, God, I don't want to hear that ever again from you. I can't take another sip without laughing. <laughs> well, then just never take another sip. I cannot hear you. <laughs> Why? I have to. Why? Why do you have to? Um. So I also almost forgot that we have eggnog. <laughs> So we're both gonna try it. Um, we're a little nervous, so we're only gonna have uh, a sip each. Hopefully we don't get drunk off of this. Just kidding, just kidding. Hopefully we do. All right, here we go. Oh my God, I almost missed it. Oh, that's creamy. <laughs> oh, that's really creamy. It kind of tastes like medicine. No, I don't want it. I'm going to try it again without judgment. It's not bad. Mmm, creamy. Do you like it? Ew. Ew. Okay, so now that I had that life altering awful experience, it is time to have a palate cleanser and, and watch The Grinch because I need something good. I am also going to bring our giant plate of cookies over to our movie theater so that we can have some if we like. 